Hi guys, welcome back to my XPS guide. Now I'm gonna guide you on this Hasiko's Revenge. So yeah, this one is pretty interesting and maybe can give you a little bit challenge. Even for me, I have died about maybe four times to figure it out how to defeat it, okay? So maybe this is not a newbie friendly trial, okay? Because I think the difficulty is above yeah, Gilgamesh battle, so Gilgamesh is not newbie friendly trial, so yeah, let's begin, okay, use items, mm -hmm. tap, 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 mm, yeah, okay, mm. okay, no limit burst, it's okay, no items, this is the objective that makes this battle insanely hard, okay, I will explain why later. If you an Esper, you don't need to bring a summoner because Hashiko has 15 million health. So unless you are super, super strong, you probably won't be able to one hit kill Hashiko. And I will use this Orlandi because like you can see here, everyone using Hyo. I know I will use Hyo too, but the point is this Hyo are equipping fire elemental weapon and Hashiko has 50% all elemental resist except for light. So I will bring Orlando and my my Hyo also equip Excalibur, okay? So yep, let's begin. These are my characters. I don't think you need to follow the same line up to defeat it. I will explain later, okay? But the point is you need super good MP battery. So on my case here, I use Ayaka as my MP battery. Okay, like you can see, why you need MP battery? Because on every turn, she gonna drain your MP until dead, okay? So, yeah, let's see. If you have an MP battery, okay, Ayaka. Let's take a look on my Ayaka. So, this my Ayaka has 900 spirit and 684. So, those are the numbers you want to achieve to make her has... MP available. So A7 stars is also able to refill your MP quite good, but it is just too random. And remember, Ace maybe not have high spirit as Ayaka. So you may have a problem when using Ace, but that can be handled if you use items. Okay, simply give Mega Elixir to Ace, and tada, you finally get you finally get MP MP to cast your MP battery skill. Okay, like you can see here, zero MP except for Awakened Rain and Ayaka. Awakened Rain Spirit is really high. I believe that's why he survived the MP drain. And yeah, I'm not sure. On every battle, she always target, I mean, make Awakened Rain Berserk. So maybe she targets highest spirit or highest health. I'm not sure, okay. But it's kind of following some pattern here. Maybe it, maybe, yeah, it, it. Maybe she target the highest health because, yeah, maybe. So the second important thing is to break her attack and magic. So you don't need Emily Technician lead, okay. Actually, if you have uh, Ramza, 7 stars Ramza, he is better than Heavenly Technician lead because he can break attack and magic 60% on the first turn. And yeah, that's it, okay. When you able to... When you're able to break her attack and magic, her MP drain won't be as deadly as before. And also, here, because you use the impregnable stance, I believe that reduced MP drain. I'm not sure, okay, but yeah, I believe it reduced. I'm not sure whether it's because because uh, because the impregnable or the magic break, which reduced the amount of MP drain. So yeah, I'm using Hyo, but I won't use his triple blade. So basically, you can change Hyo with anyone. Okay, I mean from Landy family. Okay, see, see. Okay, good. Now let's use Sharp Kick to dispel Rage Berserk. It is really important because you want to make rain to you stand out on every turn because Hashiko also has single target MP drain. So after you have 
single target provoke that will make the battle much much easier okay so let's use dedication again dedication and yeah if you have tech heavenly technician lead then make sure you use her mm, magic absorb because it is 60% so it is better than uh, better than better than her arm dissolver which only okay 5% See? 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 That's what happened when you don't have Provoker. She will drain MP from anyone, okay? So make sure you bring Provoker. So in my case, I use Awaken Rain, but really you don't need him, okay? All about all important things, I mean the most important thing about this battle is MP management, not a tanker. Like you can see, I can survive her attack quite easy okay quite easy i mean but her mp drain is really insane okay so i'm gonna use dedication again okay dedication and nicole let's cast soulful to further reduce the mp drain because the higher your spirit then the the less amount of mp will be drained Okay, improve stance. Okay, double blade. Let's see, Phantom Blade is still not available. So let's use Serpent of the Blade. And another Divine Renation. And let's use Attack Absorb. Tap tap. Okay, and basically that's it. Okay, if you're able to survive few turns, see? See what happened? She only drained MP from. Awaken Rain. So basically, what you need is Provoker, good MP battery, and you are good to go. I mean, you still need a uh, good Breaker. Those are three things you need. For attackers, you don't need to have heal, really, guys. If you still complain because I'm using heal, I'm run out of thing to say to you, okay? Because like you can see, I don't use. I don't use any triple blade, okay? So basically, it is same like Dual Wield or Landu. And Magic Restorative and Impregnable, I guess. No items, Evoke and Asper. Okay, so the Asper should be complete soon. And let's, let's switch between Barrier and Magic Absorb. So let's just use stand out, okay? Okay. Okay, Esper got ready. Spirit burn. So those are her threshold attack, but it won't as deadly as before because we have buff our stats and give damage mitigation. Okay. And now let's summon Esper. Let's just use this, okay? Because we don't need to summon any specific Esper for Ayaka. Simply another dedication for Mary Team. Let's check. We need to cast all full. And let that let's see, let's see. Let's see. So full and yeah, soul full and magical stance. So full. Magic restorative. Okay. This one. Tap tap. Tap. Okay. Deadly dress. See? Pretty simple. Unless she has another threshold attack at the end, okay? Because I haven't reached I haven't reached yeah below 40% because I simply give up. And yeah, let's just make the guide. That's what I thought before. So I still don't know about her later attack, okay? But I believe it won't be any crazy. And let's use link stance. Let's mess. Link stance, impregnable, and magic restorative, I guess. Stand out. Okay. And. No, 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 no. You cannot break her attack. I mean, defense and spirit, so it is useless. Reload. Tap, tap.
Okay, see? With 60% break and buff, she barely do any damage. Okay, tap, stand out again. So full. And magic restorative. And Ayaka dedication. Let's use attack absorb. Reload. Attack. So, yeah, maybe those are her trash all the tech. Not sure. Mm, let's use dedication. No, no, reload dedication. Reduce damage still on. So, let's use. Uh, let's use Lean Stance. Uh, where, where, where? Launch Stance for heal. Launch Stance for Orlando. To buff damage further. Okay, super invention. Reload. Tap tap. Yeah, maybe those meteor, dark meteor or whatever is her threshold attack. I'm not sure. Okay, so taps. Tap this. Mm, link stance. So cool. Impregnable. Okay, and. Let's use Magic Absorb for Awakened Rain. Actually, I should use Stand Out, but yeah, basically, even if you don't have Awakened Rain, what you did here is only... Ah, okay, so let's not use it, okay. Let's just wait. Uh, yeah, let's just use Double. No, 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 no. Yeah, let's just use Flame Blade, okay. Double blade, flame blade, flame blade, tap tap. Okay. Okay, so um, provoke also useful for for um, for draining i mean for 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 forcing berserk to that character okay because you don't want that berserk inflict your okay okay so for this turn let's use sharp kick to awaken rain forget Let's use take absorb. Okay. Okay, you all get berserk now. That's why you Okay. So this is this become quite dangerous, okay? Because Mm, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who able to dispel? Mm -hmm. Okay, I need to dispel everyone. Go out with magic. Kiraja, dispel ga. Forget. Okay. Everyone now rain I need to use his stand out 
Okay, and have only technician lead. Let's use this, okay? I'm quite lucky to have that. And for Orlando, let's just use the Fire Nation. Okay, we survived the attack. Okay, so it seems that below 50%, she will always uh, inflict Berserk. So it's better if you have Wilhelm or other character who has innate 100% draw rate. Okay, that will make the battle really, really easy, I guess. So yeah, because or we can range still has. Okay, it stands. So full magic restoration. Okay, still have provoke, so I don't need to worry that much. Okay, and let's use my magic absorb again. No, 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 double blade, seven, seven. Attack. Okay. Quite close. Okay, so I guess I will let Ruin. Yeah, I just let him, even when he doesn't have that dedication. Mm, reduce damage. No, attack. Attack break. And here. Let's use Magic Restorative Stance twice, maybe. This one and this one. Okay. Money up. Now, flash. Okay. Okay, still good. Reload, dedication. Okay, reload, tap. And let's use. Mm, let's use another magic absorb. Link stance. Soulful. Magic restorative. Quite hard, okay, quite hard, but still, very nice battle because really, really, before, yeah, before the S-Tark battle, trial battle is kind of joke, okay, many only has 4, four million health, which can be easily cheesed by Tornado Chain, but right now, we need to think and strategize, even if you have 7 stars character, if you don't plan correctly, you will be dead. Nice job, Kumi. And impregnable magic restorative. This one. Reload. Tap tap. And let's just use. No, 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 no. Magic absorb. Okay, we are close. I hope she doesn't do anything crazy. Okay, nice reload. Dedication. Take it to... Okay, awaken ruin. It's healthy again. Let's use 10 out. 
tap tap. I forgot to use all those stands, damn. Sixteen percent, it's close. Okay. This one. No, this damage is still there. Let's use too late. Too to magic restaurant. This one oh, attack absorb. I should use magic absorb on the next one. Okay. Soon in a this battle will be over. This mm -hmm. let's check, let's check, reduce damage. So full. Magic rest already. Magic absorb. Okay, let's check. The reward is quite good, okay? The spear is kinda nice, but maybe maybe not that important, okay. But still I like the rewards. I like the spear, I like weapon, but I prefer accessory. Uh, I will use education. Yeah, it looks like you are gonna die now. Let's check again. No limit burst. Check. No items. Check. Evoke an Esper. I already checked, but I will do it one more time to be safe. Okay, tap tap. Bye bye, Hashiko. Don't say you mean oh, Okay, she died. Nice. Twenty-two minutes. Quite long battle, but yeah, she has fifteen million health, so it should be take about fifteen to twenty minutes for normal players. For whale, oh, of course, you can kill it within one turn. Maybe. Okay. No limit version, no items, evoke an Esper. Hooray! Okay, nice. Before ending this video, like usual, let's talk about equipment. I kind of forgot about some of my previous video. Really sorry about equipment section, okay, but for Rain, like I said, you can replace him using Wilhelm or whatever, okay, so yeah, basically what you need is Provoker, so you may don't need Awakened Rain. Like you can see, what he uses on battle is simply stand out. For Heavenly Technician Lead, it is also not important. Okay, because I cannot use her LB, so what's the purpose? It suck. Okay, for heal, of course, make sure you equip him with light elemental weapon. Okay, that's it. Gear as high attack as possible. And for maritime statistical, it's also not that important. Okay, it's 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 empty. Okay, on ability on third ability. For Ayaka, now this is the most important piece on the battle. Like I said, to survive that, to survive that MP drain attack on the first turn, you need to have about yeah, about 600 MP and high speed, maybe about 800, to allow her to cast one dedication. You also need upgrade her dedication. Normal dedication is not good enough because it only restores 40 MP. So make sure you awaken, 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 awaken Ayaka. And yeah, you don't need her 7 stars form because 6 stars form, I believe, it's already enough. Okay, like you can see here, I also buff her MP. So try to seek balance. Before this, my Ayaka has higher spirit but lower MP and the result is bad because she cannot cast 
dedication okay with higher spirit so try to seek balance so i think that's all you need to know about this hasiko try okay thank you very much for watching please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more final fantasy brave experience guide bye bye guys